Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to record a video for you guys, a video that I have been meaning to record for quite some time. But since we are spending so much time at home, I figured this is the perfect time to record a what I eat in a day. Recently, one of my friends uh, mentioned an app that she uses to kind of record and keep track of her food. It's called the Carb Manager. You kind of punch in your information, you punch in your goals. Like personally with my goals, um, I could only have 18 grams of net carbs in a day. It tells you how, many, how much fiber you're eating. It tells me that I could have 109 grams of fat, um, 88 grams of protein, and it also gives you your net calories all the way in the bottom. So I've been really enjoying this. I've not been using it like strictly, like every single day I'm not recording breakfast, lunch, and dinner, but today I will do that just so that you guys can get an idea of how this app works. It is honestly amazing. I really, really enjoy it. Shout out to you, Ola, for sharing this with me. My friend and I started to go to the gym together occasionally and one time after the gym we went to Starbucks and she kind of showed me exactly what she does she showed me what she orders even at Starbucks so it's kind of cool I kind of I kind of am obsessed with it and a lot of my friends were asking me how did I lose weight and what are you doing and I lost a lot of weight before using this app but I feel like this just keeps me in check because sometimes you lose a lot of weight and then when you begin eating maybe treating yourself to things you're just kind of get lost again you're like I don't know if I should be eating this again like I don't know I do a lot of intermittent fasting so after like I won't have my first meal for sometimes until two depending on how how I ate the day before so I do a few things I do the I do fasting I mix fasting this app and exercise and it's kind of helping me keep my, the weight off um, so yeah I'm going to kind of make my breakfast put it in, punch it in, and show you how this thing works. Uh, I hope you enjoy. If you like this video, please share it with your friends, like the actual video, and subscribe to my channel. That really helps me a lot. Also, if you have any video ideas, I'd be more than happy to read through your suggestions. There are so many videos that I put on hold just because as a mom, I was doing a lot of errands and stuff in between dropping off and picking up kids. But since I have so much time at home right now, I wanted to crack down on some of these videos and record. Maybe I'll finally do like my furniture video. People were so curious where my furniture is from. Maybe I'll do like maybe room by room or something. I don't know. We will see. We have a lot of time to play with. Rumor has it that we might be on mandatory lockdown. Like you cannot leave your house. Um, people have been talking about it for the last few days today. I received a text message saying by the end of the weekend we might get more information than that. I know San Francisco's on lockdown. I think Orange County is on lockdown. I think we're like a week behind them. So, I mean, I hope and pray that we flatten the curve and, you know, go back to our regular lives. Very soon, this is my hubby. Hi, babe. The first thing I do is I record how much olive oil I'm going to use. So I'm making myself just my my regular eggs in the morning. Um, so with olive oil, this is a keto grade A, um, which is a good group to be in. You want to be in group A for this, you know, um, low carb diet that I'm doing. Um, so it's showing me that it's going to use 14 grams of fat, 119 calories. That's it. So I'm gonna punch that in. I'm gonna punch that in here, and I'll show you what all that looks like. breakfast it's like my regular typical breakfast sometimes I will make an avocado toast so kind of just mash the avocado up put the egg on top toast the bread and it's just like a delicious sandwich but I'm really trying to low carb here um, so yeah I'm going to punch this in and I'm gonna let you guys see how that looks I'm gonna start with the two eggs I'm using up one gram of carbs for that 16 grams of fat 
13 grams of protein and 202 calories by the way i don't know if i mentioned but my calorie like limit is 1400 according to this app then i'm gonna put in my one tablespoon of olive oil which is 14 grams of fat and 119 calories then i'm going to put in my avocado half of an avocado is six grams total carbs 10 grams of fat and one gram of protein 114 calories a cucumber i did half a cup of cucumber cucumber raw without peel half a cup let's see and then i did my silk almond milk for my latte and i did a quarter of a cup for that um this breakfast takes up a total of three net carbs 42 grams of fat 15 grams of protein and this breakfast is 472 calories so it's like a pretty big meal and yeah that's how i'm using this app right now and it kind of gives you like a pie chart and it breaks everything up and it tells you exactly what your meal is like i'm like salivating because i'm hungry it's actually really late in the day having my first meal very late um so yeah at around 5 5 30 i stopped drinking caffeinated beverages so i won't have another latte unless it's decaf um i won't have any coffee anything like that because it generally keeps me up at night but i always once or twice a day i have some tea and i've been loving this peach detox tea um as you can see i am like very low on it this is my second one actually my second box there are 16 tea bags in one i really 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 enjoy it actually when we go on walks with oscar i always bring this tea with me my husband drinks it as well so i'm going to enjoy this um maybe for the next like 20 minutes uh something about tea that i've been getting into i'm turning into a grandma and i'm okay with that <laughs> so yeah you guys can probably hear the kids playing. They are running out of ideas. <laughs> I sent them to the basement to play with Oscar. They're playing ball with him. They are very loud. <laughs> but that's okay. Anyway. My word. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to enjoy my tea. And then I will show you what I will be having for dinner. So as you noticed today, I skipped breakfast and my breakfast I had during lunch my breakfast food I had during lunch and that's very normal for me a lot of times I skip breakfast a lot of people say breakfast is the most important meal of the day I tend to just skip breakfast because I can and it's easy easier for me I tend to eat more towards the evening so like I said I just do the fasting I don't typically have an early breakfast or anything like that so i'm just going to show you what i'm making for dinner we're gonna grill we've been grilling almost every single night but we're going to grill uh we have been marinating some pork so i'm just making some pork kebabs <laughs> My dinner is the pork kebabs, some fresh green lettuce. I did put one tablespoon of Caesar dressing on the side and I just dipped my salad into that and then two little bell peppers. So far I'm at 11 grams of net carbs, 59 grams of fat, 86 out of 88 grams of protein and uh, approximately 954 calories for the day. This is pretty much my last meal of the day and my days obviously always vary. Some days I eat more, some days I eat less, but I try to stay within my net carbs and my calories for the day. Try not to cheat on those. So anyway, that is that. I'm going to enjoy my dinner. I'm going to call my family up and we are going to have our dinner finally. 
you guys I am calling it a night it is after 8 o'clock already and this is typically the time that I start to unwind Gana starts to unwind because the kids are down for the night and I either watch a show catch up on maybe a movie I've wanted to, been wanting to see or in our case right now we began reading this book the cross of Christ and um, here is my bookmark <laughs> it's like a wrapper from a house when I start to unwind for the night I usually grab like little finger food something I could snack on I did put that into my carb manager and it did throw me over a few grams of carbs which I don't care but not nothing crazy it's not like nothing major I wasn't cheating like crazy so I'm over four grams of carbs for today which I'm okay I'm okay with that I've only had 1116 calories today and I'm pretty proud of that some days I do better some days I do worse so yeah this is just a cool tool i guess i just recommend you download it and you play around with it if you do end up using it please don't forget to write let me know how you like it let me know if it's you know made an impact if you love it if just let me know your thoughts on the app if you do de decide to download it anyway you guys i will catch up with you in my next video thank you so much for hanging out and stay tuned for more videos to come this week